UFC light heavyweight champion Alex Pereira didn't hesitate to accept the huge opportunity to rematch Yuri Prohaska in the main event of UFC 303 on Saturday at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. Pereira received this offer less than two weeks ago after the main event between Conor McGregor and Michael Chandler was cancelled. Alex Pereira will return to the octagon just two months after defeating Jamahal Hill at UFC 300 back in April in record time. I am happy to accept this opportunity, said Pereira, quoted by Majunki, Tuesday, 26 June 2024. Alex Pereira revealed that he is getting older, and this will have an impact on fighting performance. According to him, this is an opportunity that must be taken. I'm going to be 37 years old. I don't know how much longer I'll be fighting. This is a good opportunity for me to stay active, keep training. I'm always training, so this opportunity should be taken whenever it comes. Alex Pereira said. Pereira's decision to accept the fight on short notice was also influenced by his opponent, Prohaska, who was predicted to be his next opponent. It's hard to say whether I would accept a fight against anyone else, but in this case it would be Yuri, Pereira said. Alex Pereira explained that this fight was not because he had fought Yuri and beaten him before, but it was a pure fight. We didn't expect it to be this soon, but we expected to fight each other, so I feel like our timing is right. If we fight in August, this is when we'll start training, said Alex Pereira. Pereira beat Prohaska to capture the vacant light heavyweight title last November at UFC 295. He doesn't expect Prohaska to change much in this rematch. I just watched his last fight yesterday, and obviously you can't compare because it's a different fight, but I don't think he's changed much since our last fight. If there's one thing I could probably change, it's my takedown defense, he said. Pereira, known for his brutal striking, will look to defend his title and cement his position as one of the most feared fighters in the UFC. Prohaska, on the other hand, will try to avenge his defeat and return to his championship path. This fight promises to be a tense and action-packed fight between two top-class fighters. Don't miss UFC 303 to see who will come out on top.